Hi guys, Philly back again. I haven't done a video in a while. I've been busy with three kids and so much stuff. But I've been wood turning for a while on my life, and I thought it'd be a good idea to do a video. I've been using wood for quite a long time. Been turning things like this. Hasn't been turned yet. This is an oak burr, bigger than my head. But I've started to get into resin turning lately because I like the look of resin and wood and metal and wood. Collaboration between the two. So I got myself some aluminite opaque. What else did I get? Aluminite clear. And loads of colours pearlescent powders and pigments and copper to play with. But the one downside of aluminite, which is lovely to turn, is the bubbles. So I needed to get rid of the bubbles. So the best way to do that, especially because of the cure time of aluminite, but the, this opaque one, working time two minutes, demolding seven. That's going to be bubbles galore. So we need a pressure pot. And I've been looking online and they're about £200, which I thought, okay, I'll save up for that, I'll buy one of those. And then when I finally came to buy one, the company had sold out. I guess there's quite a lot of people doing it at the moment, or well, they need it. So my next option was to convert a paint pot, paint pressure pot, into a pressure pot. And all the videos I seem to look at online are from some American people where they have Lowe's and Home Depot and all these great places that seem really cheap. We don't have that in the UK. We have Screwfix, Tool Station, B&Q, Wix and some private independent people. And of course eBay. I'm glad, thank good for eBay. So what I've done, I've bought myself a paint pressure pot and I'm converting it. It's going to be rated up to 80 psi. I won't be using nowhere near close to 80 psi. I believe aluminite, anything above 35, 40, will squish them bubbles just fine. Compress the air down so you won't see them. So um, stay tuned and I'll put the video together of exactly what I needed. I think my total cost was, I think it was £87.50 for my whole pressure pot. And compared to £200, it's pretty much a bargain. So if you want to see how I've done it, um, I'm not saying copy me, because I don't want to be liable if you blow your house up. But um, I'm doing it, and hopefully I don't blow this place up. Although it's a bit of an old garage, so maybe the insurance might be a good thing, but I'll stand well back, don't worry. So um, stay tuned, and I'll do it. Cheers. Subscribe.